the slow up No, I don't take shit I got no love for the fakeness If you wanna play tough and wanna hate this I'll always show up Yo, Johnny Poppers, what's poppin'? It's your boy TMV here, and today uh, we're gonna go over some PC parts to for people to have for starter builds. Um, I basically wanted to go on, um, basically to show you all that some platforms may be dead, dead, um, but they're not actually not worth it. So. If you're looking for a budget build that you can't really, you know, afford a thousand dollar build or whatever, um, or, you know, are looking for a build that you can game on and stuff, well, I have, I'm going to go ahead and build something out and show you all. So I'm not sure how much it's going to come out to. I just know the parts that I'm kind of going to base off of. So... Let's get into it. So let's go ahead and start a build. Okay, for CPU, we are going to go with a Ryzen 5. So we need to come down here and get Ryzen 5. Uh, da, 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 da. We're going to go with the Ryzen 5 56. How much is it? Oh, that's not too bad. We'll go with that one. 5600X. Good, decent CPU. Um... Be able to do quite a bit with it. Uh, we'll come back to coolers. I'm pretty sure that one will actually come with a stock cooler. So we'll come back to that. All right. Uh, da -da 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 -da. Huh. I'm going to do a micro ATX board because micros are cheaper. Uh, da -da. Oh, we also need to do AM4 platform. Let's look at ASRock stuff. Pretty sure this is actually the same board that's in my computer. Yeah, it is. Okay. Uh, we're going to go with this board. It's a pretty good board. So. Add. Let's look at the compatibility issue. Oh, it just requires a BIOS update because it's an older board. Um, not a big deal. So we're going to continue. Uh, you could also go with a newer version of the board and not have that issue. Uh, memory. Got to have memory. Uh, da -da -da -da. Everybody likes RGB, so I personally like uh, G-Skills. So. Uh... There it is, G skill. And we need DDR4. How much is their Titan Z? 80 bucks. Okay. That's actually cheaper than when I bought it. I bought it for like a hundred and seven. Was it? No, it was like $130 when I bought that kit. Because I'm running the two of those kits in my computer now. So, yeah. All right, storage. So, we can go with... I personally like Western Digital. It's all up to you guys on whatever um, perform or you know preference you guys have. I suggest to stick with brands like Western Digital, Seagate, Crucial... Um, stay away from the companies like Adata because they tend to fail and they don't care about their customers whatsoever. Um, be questionable around PNY. Um, I have had a drive fail that was made by PNY, so I don't know. All drives can fail, but 
you know, it's the fact of the matter is, is it worth the hassle of it actually failing? Not really. Um, so we're going to go with one of these drives because we got to be able to have games and downloads and random stuff to be able to have. And then we need a, we, another Western digital. Let's go with, um, this board does have M.2, but let's see how much are the M.2 prices right now. Uh, I don't know what fucking M.2 it actually is. Um, we'll just go with the normal one. Okay, yeah, we don't want the black one because the black ones tend to be a lot more. As shown, oh, that's a four terabyte, but still, as shown, 70 bucks, and that one was like 80 bucks. So $10 more. Sorry about that. Um, the camera turned off it, maxed out its recording limit. Uh, da, 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 da. okay, so we can do this guy, but I think I'm actually going to do, how much is this? Why is it a hundred and thirty fucking dollars? What? That's not right. <laughs> okay. Well, um, looks like we're going with this one. Add. You can always get more storage. Uh, I think that board has up to four storage slots on it for, for the normal SATA cables. It also has an M.2. Now, I'm pretty sure this board does have it to where you can, uh, where if you put in M.2, it cuts out the uh, one of the uh, SATA slots for the hard drives. So video card. Um... A lot of people, it kind of depends on what you want to play on and also what you want to do. So if you're looking for things like, I don't know, uh, if you want to stream or if you just want to game, big difference, okay? Like that's also, so I'm basically building it to game and stream at the same time. That's kind of what I'm looking at because a lot of people are actually wanting that. And it also helps out with performance anyways. So... I personally like the RTX family uh, because that's what I'm rocking. I'm rocking the RTX 3060. So let's go and look at that. Let's see what an RTX 3060 costs versus an RTX like 2080. 3060. Okay. All right, about 300 bucks, not too bad. What is the 2060 look like? Okay, so by the time you go and do that, you might as well just go and get the 3060. Okay, so the RTX 3070 is still pretty up there. So we're just going to go with the 3060. 3060 for 300 bucks, brand new, it's a really good card. You're not going to have a problem. Okay, case shopping. Let's stick with something like a mid tower because we don't need anything that's going to be massive because my computer case is massive. It's actually a full ATX and the motherboard looks tiny in it. It's funny. Okay, so da, 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 da. also remember we're trying to stay on a budget too. So I think I'm gonna go with the plain black uh, NZXT H5 case. Or yeah, no, we're going with that one. That one's decent priced, not too overpriced. Uh, da, 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 da. what else? Oh, we need a power supply. Uh, which one did I get? Oh, it's the 850. Yeah, that guy. 
Never cheap out on your power supplies. Whatever you do, don't cheap out. Okay. So, here's the build. And you could always go with a cheaper case. They make, you can also get them on Facebook Marketplace or uh, eBay and stuff like that. Um, cheaper ones. You can get, spend like 50 bucks. Um, sometimes you can even get a really nice case like that. For that one example, on eBay or Marketplace for like 20 bucks. Um, you could also go with like a, uh, 2060 instead of a 3060. Um, you also don't really need 32 gigs of RAM, but if you want to stream, I'd recommend 32 gigs of RAM. Uh, th that's the biggest thing. So, with this point done, yes, uh, it is a dead platform for AM4. And I probably will be doing a uh, build um, thing for AM5, for a decent build for AM5. It'll probably cost a lot more. Like, not going to lie, probably closer to about 1500 to two grand. Depends. I'm not sure yet. Uh, anyways, the reason why I sit there and say that if you're looking for it, because, like, I keep seeing videos from, like, Carter's PC and other people that are sitting there saying, don't go with AM4. AM4 is a dead platform. Yes, it technically is a dead platform because they're not making anything for AM4 anymore. And AM5 is going to be that way soon. But for now, AM4 is still here to stick around it. A lot of this stuff, uh, you could probably still get probably a good six to eight years, if not more, out of it and not have an issue. They're still really high powerful components, but if you're going to, if you have the extra money, definitely go and get the AM5, 100%. Um, but if you're really balling on a budget, and especially if you can pick up some of these parts used, you're going to be in luck. I keep seeing AM5, um, or not AM5, Ryzen 5 CPUs on Facebook Marketplace all the time. So definitely take a look into it. So if you're looking for a PC, remember to look around. Also, you can go with a even less uh, build and go and even go to the uh, 30, 3000 series on the Ryzen 5s. I'm running the um, Ryzen 7 3700X uh, CPU, so... It's yes, it's old, but not that old. I've only had this computer for two, three years now, and it's amazing. It still runs like brand new. So, yeah. With that being said, guys, don't forget to like and subscribe, and uh, make sure you share this with your friends uh, that is looking for computers and stuff. With that being said, guys, I'll see you next time. Watch me Peace. as I take off I'll be working until I have all of my days off Then I'm surfing in California when I'm paid off I'll be blurring my vision, sipping on